Woohoo! So that is what they call a state of flow. I had no idea that that was like 20 friggin' minutes. I figured that was about the end of the level. I got an S rank finally. That level seemed like five times harder than everything else in the entire game. So far, at least. Not counting the. What is this? Bubble Hurricane. So let's see what the next boss is. But. About flow. That is a good thing, though. You always want. Um, well, a state of flow is just when you, the user usually loses a sense of time, which I just did, and has a complete immersion in, you know, the task, like playing the game. Video games are very good at, well, good video games are very good at instilling flow in someone, and it's how you get, you know, your best work done if... Like, if I'm in a state of flow when I'm programming, you know, I get my shit done, I get it done well, um, like, in terms of speed and quality, you know, my stuff will be about ten times better when I'm in flow than when I'm not. And... Video games, yes. Ow. Video games are pretty good at doing that. What are you doing, Mr. Fireball? Not sure what to think of you. Okay, you're dead. The, um, I must say, the... Switches and boss, um... What you call it? Attack pattern? They're a bit abrupt and, um... Abrupt and formulaic without, uh, like, usually in bullet hell games, the boss will, like, change forms or whatever. Um, and all of a sudden they have a reason to change attacking. But, ow, that is very dense. Um, myself and the bullet patterns. But, no, I don't mind it too much. Now, part of the problem is the bosses are all pretty much just, um, Stand, um, not animated sprites. Ow. Oh, I was so close, too. Save your bombs when you're getting cornered by bullets. Well, obviously. But, should have learned that by now. But, yeah. So, the reason video games are so addicting and you get yourself lost in them, it's pretty much the issue of flow. It's pretty easy for even partially decently developed or designed game to do that to you. Something like a word editor, um, you know, most any sort of uh, clerical work, you can have a state of flow, like, you know, me and programming. It's just really hard to bring that about. And a big part of that is not interrupting the user with stupid stuff and allowing them a good sense of control, which, you know... Video games are pretty good at that. If they weren't good at that, they wouldn't be video games. Not good ones, anyway. Is this guy, like, partially based on my movements? Like, the way that guy moves? He just moves in an odd pattern. I'm trying to figure that out. Explodies everywhere. Oh, I'm not sure if I mentioned explicitly, but I did want to say... I'm really glad there is an auto-fire button, especially for a lance, because it's really helpful. But I hate having to constantly hold down the X button or whatever in some games where, you know, there's never a reason to not be firing. Why do you give... why is there no constant fire option? And in this game, there is a reason to not be firing fairly often, but, uh, ow. But it's nice that the option is there. Oh, crap. Please die. Okay, thanks. Okay, getting close. No more bombs. So pretty. Oh no! I love that the boss stages are not long though. It's pretty much just... Um, he seems to be intentionally trying to give you um, a way to farm cash. Which, by the way, I probably have shit tons of money by it now. Uh, a quick way to farm cash in case you can't beat the boss. Which, I guess it's okay. But in a situation like this, I would just hope that the final set of levels are just set so that 
it's still going to be really difficult even if you have fully upgraded like you should at a certain point you should be expecting them to be fully upgraded and the difficulty should be based on that because if you don't do that it can be incredibly easy to beat your last areas as long as you have uh maxed upgrades and you know these bullet patterns aren't even that tight and i'm still stopping like slack jawed every time it starts ow Gundamonium games give me way worse than this, but I'm also way, way, way more used to those. And I know what to expect in all of... almost all of them. Though out of all three games, I've only beaten one of the true final bosses, because they're absolute bitches, both to get to and then to beat. I really want to do videos for those now. Well, I do not like this pattern. Or this... yeah, I guess it's a pattern. It's... I mean, there's occasionally gaps, but it seems like sometimes there aren't good gaps to... Oh. Uh, I should really see what... Yeah, I figured I had lots of money. Let's... Yeah, more base damage. Movement speed... not really gonna help. I guess let's get some more magnets. What point do these max out at? Wait, so if this goes to 7, would I have 10 hearts now? If I were upgrading health? It's probably a good deal of why I'm having so much trouble, you know? Because the hearts have been really cheap so far that I saw, so... I'm sure I could probably have... I could definitely have, like, 6 hearts at least. I'm just making it excessively difficult on myself. But... The point of these games is being excessively difficult, so I'm accepting no less. Also, I kind of like getting the uh, power-ups before the boss, though the the shield power-up is... Yeah, though I kind of want the shield power-up for this boss. But the shield power-up can totally break the first uh, few seconds of the boss fight. But I like having the attack things, you know, you deal a little bit of extra damage. It's not excessive, but it's nice. Ow! I suck. Ugh. Okay. And most of these patterns, just keeping at a distance. He's definitely moving when I move. He just has a set pattern and moves in a when I do. Okay, die already. Well, next. Ow! No! Crap. Okay, I'm saving the other bomb for the really... Crap. Dense waves of... Damn it. The dense waves of damn it. I should really get another bomb. Hmm. You know what, I'm going to go back and get an S rank on all of these and I'll probably have B. I'll have another bomb, at least. Be able to tackle this better. Hey, got Anna. So, I was hoping Anna would be good. She really friggin' is. I don't think I mentioned... You get new characters based on how many medals you have. Or how many medals you get. I'm pretty sure I got... Natty at 5, Lance at 10, and Anna at 15. The ones I got were... The 10,000 enemies 1, and... Fully upgrade any stats. I upgraded main weapon speed. What can I get? Let's get that. And that is maxed. Excellent. We can't get anything else. Oh, I just noticed the the icons are specialized to your uh, your actual character's uh, abilities. Like that's what her bomb looks like. That's her sub weapon. So she has extremely fast, constant barrage of arrows as her main attack, and her sub attack you'll have to see. It's pretty freaking awesome. It is this. It's basically little um, leaves that are kind of um, the like helper ship things that shoot for you. They're called uh, options in shoot 'em ups. I'm not sure why they're called options. Like they're little helper ships. And I'm not sure why why options comes out of that, but whatever. Maybe some weird Japanese translation or something. Cause 
Yeah, the early ones were all definitely... The early good ones, anyway, were pretty much all Japanese. But yeah, the, if you didn't notice, the options last a freaking long time when you start them up. A long time. And they recharge pretty quick. So they're pretty much around almost forever. And she does crazy high damage. Especially with the uh, these guys. These guys help you take out normal enemies like freaking crazy. Ow. Please stop. <sighs> is it just after I take the hit, of course? That is her bomb. I think you saw it before, but uh, it's just... It's sort of like Lance's thing, where it blows away bullets, but it's just sort of in a ring around her, instead of a beam forward. So you just kind of want to get near the... Ugh, screw it. Near the boss to do the damage. Thank you. Let's see if we can live. Not sure why I'm having such a difficulty. I think it's because of, ow, shit. I cannot focus that well on something small. I think it's because I'm using glasses and I hate glasses. Yeah, these things create help your spread like crazy. Also, when you get um, the attack power up thing, she just shoots leaves to give you more firepower and spread, just like the uh, sub attack. I mean, look how slowly the sub-attack charges. That's mostly because I have the uh, sub-weapon maxed. But... You can have it almost... On almost for, like, ever. It's wonderful. Also, all of those guys are definitely to help you, uh... Farm money. For the boss. Damn it. Suck. Oh well. Uh, what? Ah, uh, I'm oh, terrible. After I beat this guy, I'm definitely quitting for the night. I'm doing terrible. Oh, I should not have done that, but whatever. Oh hey, thingies go. Oh, they're almost out. Okay, wait for like a second. There we go. Fireworks. I love fireworks. I like them less when they rain on holy death upon me, but ow. Okay, that's it. No more Mr. Nice Female Person. No more Mr. Female Person at all. It's Mrs. Female Person. Who are you calling Miss? Tur. You Sphinx thing. I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, ah. I see the pattern going on here, but I can't do much about it. Ugh. I'm... I'm gonna call it a night. You know what? I'm gonna try the uh, bubbles thingy, though. Bubble hurricane. I can't buy anything, can I? I don't really need more speed. I need another bomb. That's what I need. The bonus level. Oh, sorry. The machines. Yeah. They're going to be crap tons of bullets. That's what I like. As I think I said, you should always play this as big as you can. So you can be as accurate as you can. Especially when you're making teeny little movements like this. I love these, the patterns for the... It's like a freaking waltz of bubbles of death. It's all pretty. It's like they're dancing while trying to kill me. It's wonderful. Yeah, I wish when things were going to kill you, they'd at least have, you know... The class to do it while dancing. That would make the fact that you're being murdered just so much more bearable. It's like, wow, this this is a high class murder. Ow. You didn't get to see that bubble pattern. So I used a bomb. Ooh, pretty. And pretty easy to dodge, really. What do you got? What do you got? Whoa. Ah, you're tracking me now. I see what's up. Oh, forgot my option thingies. That's not good. Let's see what your final thing is. Well, that's a classic. Too bad you can't use it. Haha, <laughs> you die. 
That wasn't too bad. Would I get an A rank, B rank? Probably B, because I got th three hits. That's pretty bad. Oh, hey. What is that? I got something. Let us see what that metal is. Oh, sweet. I mean, level except survival. Yeah, I'm going to quit for the night. Actually, I'm going to take a peek at what this is. It's probably, it's the fourth boss, or the third boss. And it's going to be, oh, it just told us the, uh, what you need to do for an A rank and S, or, uh, S rank. It's full of stars. I love these bullet patterns so hard. Do I want to do a bullet hell game just to make algorithms for very pretty bullet patterns? Beautiful. Oh, damn it. Oh, wow. I thought it was further than like an eighth of his life through. Next time, we will try to suck less. And I will have at least one more bomb, so maybe I'll live longer.